I've got so much to do for this wedding and absolutely no time to do it. So today is literally gonna be a mission to get some shoes for my wedding. So for those of you that are here to see an adventure video, then, then maybe, maybe come back next week. Because today, I'm on a mission. Try a couple more stores. Thing is, you don't actually have to wear masks in um, in shops anymore. But the last thing I need on my wedding day is COVID. I think the biggest problem is there's just so much to choose from, and they're all pretty similar. Shoes, 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 shoes. Have you got these in a nine? A nine. Can I look for you? Cheers. Thank you. <laughs> I've got my shoes probably say one of the most important things for me is time and what I mean by that is making time to do the things that you love doing but also making time for family and also making time just to get things done that need to be done like today getting those shoes was something that I had to do one of the main reasons why I make the most out of every opportunity is because when I was in my early 20s I think I was about 22 I lost someone dear to me and this switch kind of just went off in my head where I realized that life is too short. I kind of made this vow that I, I never wanted to look back at a situation and think I wish I'd done that. At the time I spent years of my life working as much as I could, not taking any holiday so I could spend six weeks in New Zealand. But then there's other times when, when time isn't spent wisely. Like a couple of weeks ago where it took me an hour to drive down to Porth Hallow. So I came down to Paul Fallow because I thought, do you know what, even if it's really windy, like it is, at least I can go in the sea. But I don't even think I can do that. Time is one of those things that you will never be able to make any more of. You can always earn more money, but spending time with family, the precious things, that's something that you'll never be able to get back. So it's all about just making the most of every opportunity you've got. Whether that's to spend it with family, whether it's getting out and exploring places, you never know when your time's up. But on that note, I might have time for a quick swim. What a difference half an hour down the road can make. Like, when I left Truro, it was all cloudy and overcast, and now in Falmouth, it's absolutely stunning. The sun's out, it's nice and blue. Lovely. Now walking through the botanical gardens of Falmouth in full gear, because you know, I like to do that now. This seems to be my new thing, apparently. to mention as well happy Easter it's actually not that busy down here on Gilly for Easter weekend a bit strange just realized I just got walked all the way down here and I didn't bring my fins all this rushing around this is a prime example of me wasting my time shoes are still there Absolutely sweating now after having to go back and get them. Oh, that's better. Oh, a bit of cold water. Oh, rocks here. Again, whoa. Me being me probably haven't chose the best place to come out. Very slippery. It's a clearing here anyway. Right, I'm in anyway. Close it.
Hello, give him a wave. He's waving at you. Bless him. Alright, I'm gonna put him back. Tell you one thing, I'm not walking back in all this. No way. If I stiff that in a in a fin. One way to carry it, right? Definitely not wearing the gloves. You can keep the belt on because that's probably the easiest way to carry that. Cooler and easier to carry. I'm gonna head home and show Kate the shoes I bought. She's gonna be so impressed. Look at him. Got some shoes. Yeah, lovely. It took me all day to get them. Why? <laughs>